Have you ever wondered how yoga helps with anxiety? If so, this video is for you. Hi, I'm Melissa from Yoga with Melissa. I offer real yoga for real people. We're all about connection. Connection with the teacher and teachings that allow you to connect with your true self and to a community of people who support each other on a genuine path of spiritual transformation. If you're new here, be sure to subscribe and turn on those notifications because in the month of January of 2018, I am putting out a brand new video like this every single day for our new year 30 day yoga challenge. So on day 10, you're going to get a video called how to do yoga breathing. And then on day 11, you are going to get another brand new yoga video on how to do reduce stress with yoga. On day 12, you're going to get another highly requested yoga video on how to relax with yoga. And in those videos, I'm going to share with you some of my most requested yoga poses. So if this sounds like something that interests you, then subscribe and press that little bell so you do not miss a single video in our 30-day challenge this month. So a 2017 publication in the Wright State University Core Scholar found that yoga intervention trials, including physical postures, meditation, and breathing exercises resulted in statistically significant decreases in stress scores and biomarkers. The research also showed lower anxiety relapse in the yoga group compared with uh, yoga groups with medication. So I'll leave the link to that in the show notes. So the research has been showing for many years that yoga reduces anxiety. But just how does it do it? Well, today we are going to focus on one way. A 2017 study in the Journal of Yoga Philosophy, Psychology, and Parapsychology found that Nadi Shodhana, or alternate nostril breathing, was an effective way of lowering anxiety for their pilot group. And if you click on Show More, you'll get the show notes, and that's where the links to these studies are. So how did this work exactly? Well, the authors of the study suggested that the breath itself stimulated the mechanical receptors in the nasal passage that activate the signal and signal the hypothalamus or the highest center for autonomic regulation, which means heart rate, respiratory rate, and digestion, etc. So they cite also that previous studies, which uh, suggest that yoga breathing balances the autonomic nervous system. And they state that overall there is a parasympathetic dominance, that is the rest and digest, after the practice of alternate nostril breathing. So how about we try alternate nostril breathing together? So the way that I like to do it is you... Uh, extend your first two fingers on your right hand and you place it on the center of your forehead because you also have a marma point here which is actually quite calming and with your left hand bring your thumb and index finger together extend your other three fingers and then you're going to close your right nostril and close it right at the top right underneath the, the bump here so and close it gently you're going to breathe in gently through your left nostril. So this is known also as the sweet breath. So you don't need to do it really aggressively. You're going to breathe in through your left nostril. Close left and breathe out through your right nostril. Breathe in through your right nostril. Close right and breathe out through your left nostril. Breathe in left. Close left, breathe out right. Breathe in right. Close right, breathe out left. Breathe in left. Close 
close left, breathe out right. Breathe in right. Close right, breathe out left. And then lower your right hand down and feel the effects of this breath practice in your body. If you made it all the way to the end of the video, then leave the words, breathing helps with anxiety in the comments. I look forward to seeing you tomorrow when we will be talking about how to do yoga breathing even more breathing. So thanks so much for watching. If you know somebody who would benefit with, from this video, then please share it with them. And as always, I love all those thumbs up and the uh, videos as well. Namaste.